Multiplying villainies of nature do swarm upon him. What the hell? Bugger off! Disdaining fortune with his British steel, which smoked with bloody execution. We're finger men, pal! <laughs> Devotion's visage and pious action, we do sugar or the devil himself. What's that mean? Spare the rod. <laughs> I can assure you, I mean you no harm. Who are you? Who? Who is but the form following the function of what, and what I am is a man in a mask. Well, I can see that. Of course you can. I'm not questioning your powers of observation. I'm merely remarking upon the paradox of asking a masked man who he is. Oh, right. But on this most auspicious of nights, permit me then, in lieu of the more commonplace soubriquet, to suggest the character of this dramatis persona. Voila! In view, a humble vaudevillian veteran, cast vicariously as both victim and villain by the vicissitudes of fate. This visage, no mere veneer of vanity, is a vestige of the vox populi, now vacant, vanished. However, this valorous visitation of a bygone vexation stands vivified and has vowed to vanquish these venal and virulent vermin, vanguarding vice and vouchsafing the violently vicious and voracious violation of volition. The only verdict is vengeance, a vendetta held as a votive, not in vain, for the value and veracity of such shall one day vindicate the vigilant and the virtuous. <laughs> Verily, this vicious soise of verbiage veers most verbose, so let me simply add that it's my very good honor to meet you, and you may call me V. Are you like a crazy person? 